Welcome back, Americans! No, come, you can build a Disneyland near Paris. We won't go, but build it. And we'll have a Minnie Mouse with armpit hair. It'll be great. Smoking a gal was going, I never loved Mickey, you know that. What, he has three fingers. What am I, a bowling ball? Fuck off. Don't love him. You're crass, rat like bastard, I don't care. But there is one country that watches out for all of us. The Swiss, yeah. The Geneva Convention. If there is ever a nuclear war, they will be the only people going, what was that noise? In their big hollowed out country with their chocolate and their watches, yeah. The nice Germans, yeah. Or as they like to say, the other white race, nah. I have only one question. How can you trust an army? How butch is an army that has a wine opener on its knife? Many of you men have never opened Chardonnay under fire. First of all, you take out the wine till you pull at the cork, smell it, say meat or fish and throw. I don't know, but I've been told Chardonnay must be served cold. Yeah! Oh, but my God, where did all this impressionistic art come from? And all this jewelry from 1939 to 1945. <laughs> Fairies must have brought it during the night. <laughs> Suddenly I have to do the Waldheimlich and cough up an account number. <gasps> For God! I know there's one thing. I know there is one country that is not developing some horrible weapon of destruction that does not have a secret weapons lab up in the mountains. Jamaica. <laughs> I man. Jamaica would never make an atomic bomb. They may make an atomic bomb. <laughs> but I'd rather fight a war with the atomic bomb, because when the atomic bomb goes off, there's devastation and radiation. When the atomic bomb goes off, there's celebration. I and I look at an I and I and I recommend a girl of Rastafari. I rebuck it, because Rastafari I smoke this bleep for the communion. If you don't see Jesus, then you never will, ma. <laughs> I tell you, because I met this one thing, man. I know only one thing. I never met me an angry pot smoker. I never met a man who's going, Hey, you fucking prick! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you see, marijuana. I know this one. Wait. A oh. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh. Okay. If you smoke a lot of pot, you may never become a rocket scientist, or maybe. <laughs> if you've seen some of the things that have happened recently with NASA, maybe you can. <laughs> Okay, uh, okay, okay, here's a fun. Oh, fuck. Okay, okay, the Mars lander, okay? Fuck. I did the calculations in feet, but I programmed the lander in meters. Oops. So instead of landing, fucker buried. $185 million, whoopsie. Two years flat. Oh, okay, fuck, here's a better one. Okay. The Hubble telescope. <laughs> I forgot to put in a lens. <laughs> Read the top line. Uh, Alpha Centauri, uh, Sirius, the rest is just a black hole. <laughs> I once called Stephen Hawking's house. Hello, this is Stephen Hawking. Yes, I'd like to leave a message. No, this is Stephen Hawking. <laughs> I know one thing, though. You know, Pot is not like alcohol. Alcohol changes your mood sometimes. Like, go to a bar at happy hour and see some just happy motherfuckers there. <laughs> see those guys going, hey, fuck you, my man. Hey, hey, listen to me. Listen to me, you piece of shit. Listen, you do not know shit about fuck, my man. You want a piece of yourself? Hmm? Step outside, I'll kick my ass. Come on. I've already shit myself. I'm halfway there. Come on. Come on, you fucker. 
And some people know you've got a, you can deal with it genetically. You know if you're Irish, you've got a running start that you can do it better than we are. You know that because if you're Irish, you know, you'll kick my ass, but then you'll fucking sing about it afterwards. <laughs> oh, that night you said my wife was fat. I knocked you down and shit in your hat. Away the time we go, the bit. Coming away for real. Moving the time, my lawyer. And then you keep drinking till you're in your 80s and you're on a dialysis machine doing liver dance and Michael Flatline. Beep. And they say the Irish saved civilization, drank a couple of Guinness and forgot where they fucking put it. But that's all right. Here's the drill. And the Japanese, they drink differently than us. It is a different thing. You can be very polite during the day and all of a sudden you arigato with us. And after five Jack Daniels, <laughs> Yellow River! <laughs> hey, for God! Karaoke for asshole with a microphone! Sing you round that fuck, come on! <laughs> and if you want a linguistic adventure, go drinking with a Scotsman. Because you can't fucking understand them before. You land in Scotland and they're going, Do you look if you like? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, right, you dig it, eh? Fuck, can't even put like burning the bullets at the scene of it, can't put in your neck of it. Sure. Oh, fuck, sure, eh? Man, you know the bump in the backside of the tweak, you're laughing at the floor of it, can't be, eh? Sure. Oh, sure, you dumb fucking bastard. You realise that, eh? And you realise how drunk they get, they could wear a skirt and not dare. And how they could invent a sport like golf. Here's my idea for a fucking sport. I knock a ball in a gopher hole. Oh, you mean like pool? Fuck off, pool! Not with a straight stick, with a little fucked up stick. I whack a ball that goes in a gopher hole. Oh, you mean like croquet? Fuck croquet! I put the whole hundreds of yards away! Oh, like a bowling thing. Fuck no! Not straight, I put shit in the way. Like trees and bushes and high glass. So you can lose your fucking ball and go whacking away with a fucking tire iron. Whacking away and each time you miss you feel like you're gonna have a stroke. Fuck, that's what we'll call it. A stroke, cause every time you miss you feel like you're gonna fucking die. Oh, great. Oh, here's a bit of fun. Oh, fuck, this is brilliant. Right near the end, I'll put a flat piece with a little flag to give you fucking hope. <laughs> but then I'll put a pool and a sandbox to fuck with your ball again. <laughs> ah, you'll be there trashing your ass, jerking away in the sand. <laughs> oh, you do this one time. Fuck no! <laughs> Eighteen fucking times! The manly sport of golf, where you can dress like a pimp and no one will care. <laughs> where you can wear clothes and even a blind gay man would go, oh dear Christ. <laughs> Those are loud. This is not carnival. What the fuck are you on? <laughs> even the alligator's going, asshole. <laughs> and you get in the, it's such an exciting athletic sport too. Whack the ball, get in the cart. <laughs> Whack the ball, get in the cart. And the commentary's electrifying. Just this side of curling for really getting me going. I'm on the third green now. Could people be quieter? I'd like to hear the grass grow. I want the guy who does Mexican soccer to do golf one time. The ball is running. The ball is going to the... 